Athletes came out to compete in the Madison County Track and Field Special Olympics today. R. Kelly Kennedy went out to see how the competition is impacting the athletes. I'm excited. I dreamed of my first place, baby. Special Olympics started as a backyard summer camp. The event is still changing lives 50 years later. Well, Cassie has been doing this since she was eight years old, and she's 33 now. So we come every year. I've been doing this for quite a while, and uh, I get just as much enjoyment out of it as they do. This annual event is giving people with intellectual disabilities the chance to develop physical fitness. I just walked so hard, getting a hard to breathe, and my heart's racing. I just think that gives them a great sense of satisfaction to know that they can participate in the same events as other students and uh, adults. The athletes came out for a good time, but volunteers say they've seen the participants gain a boost in confidence. He told me to go like this. This one individual comes out, he's, his personality is off the chart. Whether he comes in first, second, or third, or, or just or gets a participant, he, he just feels good about himself. We get to see a lot of old friends here over the years. She's met so many people. She gets to have a, like a reunion here with those people. Parents say the athletes look forward to the event all year. Putting the Valley first, Kelly Kennedy, WZDX News. The goal of the Special Olympics is to give people with intellectual disabilities a way to take control of their health.